Hi guys, it's been quite a while since I have done a video. So this is my first makeup video again after having the house done. Still got boxes and all sorts to, <coughs> to unpack. But anyway, I'll do my best. I know this is not the best camera. This is my um, PC camera, so it's not the same kind of quality. But here we go. Today I'm going to be using the new Son Sonia Mineral Makeup. And this is the natural, tone natural, some into this yogurt pot. Comes with this sort of swivel kind of thing. It's not my favorite, I must admit. Especially not if you've got fingernails. There you go. So I've got some in here. So I'm now taking my short flat top brush and dabbing that in tapping it out and applying it and you have to buff it very well dab tap and buff If you're wondering how much I used, it was sort of like a thumbnail size of mineral makeup. There you go. Um, on this video, I oh, now I've thrown it down onto the floor. On this video, I want you please to read also the information below because it will contain something that might be of interest to you. Right, now I'm going to do this all in a different way than I usually do. So I'm now taking the mauve blush and using my whisper brush, tapping that in lightly, tapping that the excess off and just applying it lightly okay, for those of you that aren't used to using a lot of makeup this whisper brush which hasn't got which is not so terribly dense yeah, is the best because you won't be picking up that much makeup using dusty rose for a natural look and applying that directly there you go and I think girls I've also forgotten my mascara but there you go and now we'll come on to the eyeshadows and I'm going to be using today um, maple syrup which I'm going to be applying now and that is for the eyebrows so I'm dabbing that into the angled eyeliner side of the brush and just applying that lightly just to make the eyebrows that tiny bit darker and to frame the face going to use as my base eyeshadow I'm going to use Sunfire and I'm using the angle fluff brush I'm tapping that into the whole surface of that and applying it over the lid if you're wondering why I've chosen these colours is yesterday I was walking in in the rain looking at the field and what stuck out was the wheat grass as in the wheat and the thistles and it was just a lovely colour combination I thought yes that's what I will do 
And now I'm going on to wild berry. This time I'm going to use the tip of the brush, tapping the excess off and applying that on the outer corner of the eye. I'm going upwards into the crease. And you start off little by little, forming that V. These are synthetic brushes. They're 100% vegan. And they don't pick up as much makeup as the natural hair ones, which is a lot better because you can apply the layers a lot better. And they hold longer too. So, and now you just, what you've got there on colour, you just pan out, upwards and inwards. upwards and inwards. You don't need any more eyeshadow. Upwards and inwards. So that's for the colour touch. And then I'm going to use uh, French vanilla. I'm applying that on the whole base of the brush just applying it under the brow and if the purple needs some correction you can go into that it's a very light summery look with that hint of color and glimmer which looks very nice on bronzed skin And, oh dear me, I have forgotten, I have forgotten the mascara, but that does not matter, because I shall now improvise. What do you do when you've forgotten your mascara? Okay, you take the eyebrow angled eyeliner brush, you wet it. And you paint your eyelashes. There. So the eyelashes are done. I don't know if you can see that takes maybe a little longer than with mascara, but it doesn't matter. And just to finish the look off, I'm going to now use the same angled eyeliner brush, dab it into the wild berry, and just apply a tiny bit underneath the outer corner of each eye, just to bring the colors together. And to accentuate the top with the same angled eyeliner brush, only up to where you have put the wild berry up on the upper lid, just accentuate that V a little bit, like that. There you have a very summery look with that hint of colour, but not too much. I hope you enjoyed that. See you soon, guys. Bye.